Welcome back. It's literally been less than like 10 seconds later than after I have, a uh, how do you say, stopped recording. We are now going to save those fuzzies because last time we, Merlin told us this is where we need to go. So let's go and save the Koopas from the fuzzies. We saved him. He's got his shell back. Oh, thank you, Mario. I owe you one. I just can't walk around without my shell on. Talk about embarrassing. Mario, be sure to keep your shell safe from fuzzies, all right? Oops. Well, you don't have one. Well, watch your overalls. How kind. Help this Koopa out right here. And he'll be happy and jump around. Oh, you're the best. Thank you very much. All right. And, all right. So this one's easy, too. Just hit it with the B. Thanks, Mario. This shell was made to order. That's why it fits me so well. I mean, how cool do I look? That's nice. Let's check these real quick. Oh, a Koopa Leaf. Got one of these earlier, but they just restored 3 FP. Just check. Alright. We'll check the, the blue house later. Let's start with this red one, huh? Just a toad house. We don't need to worry about that right now. Uh, we're not going into the shop, so... Looks like our only option is this blue one. Supposedly, these Bobons recently ran away from Koopa Bros Fortress. Of course, things aren't much better here in the village. The fuzzies are running wild. Poor little Bobombs. Huh? Me? I don't leave my house because I couldn't bear it if the fuzzies made a fool of me. They probably would take my shell and play with it. I don't know. I know I don't look cool without my shell. Nope. No thank you. I'd rather sit here and listen to music. Good for you, Koopa. I'm not going to hate on you about that, because I do the exact same thing. Alright, uh, more fuzzy trouble. This fuzzy is not being nice at all. Alright, I'm giving up. I'm coming back to that one later. I just wasted like two minutes. Like, yeah, way too long just doing that. Pretty sure we need something else for that anyways. Let's save this Cooper for now. I might have known. You're so clever, Mario. Uh, okay. Let's check this bush. Nothing. Let's check this tree. Nothing. Oh! Oh, that's another one of the fuzzies. Okay. Let's go into this house that's being a little crazy. Who cares? I'm kind of busy. Who's there? My apologies. What? Wait, could it be? Are you Mario? You are! My name's Cooper. I'm so psyched to meet you. Us meeting here has got to be fate or something. I need a huge favor. I hope you can help me out. This wild fuzzy took my shell, which is next to my life, is the most important thing I have. I can't go out without my shell, period. That's way too embarrassing. The problem is, the fuzzies are too fast for me to catch alone. So if you don't mind, could you help me get my shell back? I'm begging you! Hey Mario, this guy looks like he's in the bat. This guy looks like he's in a bad way. We gotta help him out. The fuzzy took my shell. That's just inside this house. I'll guard the door. while you grab him like whoop. All right, let's go help this guy out, huh? Me York. All right, well let's follow him out, huh? He's got a back door and everything. Uh oh, I see a lot of fuzzies, and I see a badge. Ho ho. There's four trees, and you just, how are we supposed to get them now? Mealark, Mealark, come and get me if you can. Yeah. Well, that's not good. Mealark, guess where I'm hiding? Alright, this is kind of difficult, but it's really easy when it comes down to it. They'll just, you don't really lose anything from getting it wrong. They'll just fight you. And like, that's not that big of a deal. Meow, not bad, chump, but that was just a warm-up. Yeah, I can just commentate through this whole thing, and I'm pretty sure I'll get it right every time. I got that hand-eye coordination and all that. Ooh, tried to trick me there. Nah, 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 we don't fall for that. And this one's gonna be a little fast. York? York? You got me twice? Must have been luck. Now I'm serious. Yeah, this time it's gonna be pretty fast, gotta say. So, I'm not sure if I'll be quiet, but... Oh, wow. 
That, I almost missed that, not gonna lie. Meow, no, I give up, uncle. Here, take this stupid shell. You got Cooper's shell. You're too tough for me. I won't be bad anymore, I promise. Maybe. Maybe. Mario, there you are. I realize I have to take a stand against these fuzzies. If I can't get my own shell, I'll lose my reputation. I don't even care that I have my, no shell on. I'm gonna show these fuzzies what's what. We already got the shell back. Oh yes, yes! This is my shell, all right. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I got my shell back. Uh-huh. You're the greatest, Mario. I owe you big time. Good to hear you're happy. Goombario's a boy. Say, Mario, I have an idea. Do you happen to know Professor Colorado? No, I don't. I've never heard of this man. Naturally, he's a Koopa who's a professor of archaeology. He's known as an explorer. Right. Well, I live next to him. I've been admiring Professor Colorado since I was just in my egg. Nothing would make me happier than traveling the world, solving mysteries like he does. So, do you think I could, uh... Please help me with you, Mario. I'll help. Come on, let me go. What do you think, Mario? Uh, I've learned that saying don't take is not and saying no doesn't end well in this game, so we're just gonna say yes. Oh, yes, yes, I'm on my way. I swear, I, Koopa, will follow you anywhere, even to the ends of the earth. And we have our second party member, Cooper. Press uh, down yellow button, also known as my right joystick, which I messed up last, a few episodes ago. To shoot him. When in battle, he can attack enemies with the ground with his shell toss, or attack all enemies of the ground with his power shell. When you want to switch to your partner, press the Y yellow button or my right joystick to select. Yeah, see, I can switch between them now, and he has this thing where he can go back like that. So let's move on, huh? New York! I changed my mind, sucker. How about a fight? And he brings off his fuzzy buddies. So these are fuzzies, and let's show off what my boy Cooper could do. But first, we need Goombario to do his tile thing. So, uh, I think we'll just jump out one of them. I know they're trying to show off fuzzies, but... Oh, uh, I'm gonna take a lot of damage from this. Maybe it wasn't the greatest idea to do this. Uh-oh, this is getting a little dangerous. Okay, we're healing immediately. This is good. That was not. This is not good. 8 HP, okay. Towel, and then we're switching right back to Cooper. This is a fuzzy. Why do fuzzies always jump up and down? They need to chill out. Max HP is 3, attack power is 1, defense power is 0. The problem with fuzzies is that their quickness. It's really tough to time their attacks. If they latch onto you, watch out, they'll absorb your HP. Now, I'm pretty sure I'm just not going to use Cooper this battle. I'm going to show off what he can do in a later battle. Because this, this, this is dangerous. That's all I'm saying. So we're just going to finish these guys off quickly. Because I just lost 4 HP. Just like that. So we're just going to use the Fire Flower for once. And just let that do it. We'll show off Cooper's abilities in the next battle. So I don't think they'll be showing any new characters at that time. 12 star points! Yeah. Mjork! No! We'll be good! We'll be good! I'm not sure how often we'll actually see fuzzies, honestly. Wait a minute, why am I going to the menu? I can just switch like that. So, remember that badge earlier that I passed by that I commented on for like 3 seconds? Let's get it, huh? That's Cooper's ability. He can like, he just does that and it's extremely helpful. He can slide off of different platforms, some that we can't reach, and he can easily help you get it. Get items is what I should say, but I didn't. Haha. <laughs> All right, as you can see, the town is at peace and I don't have to do this. <sighs> that was annoying. Technically, you don't have to do any of those, but you don't have to help any of the Koopas. But we did anyways. Let's check this tree. Nothing. Alright, let's uh, heal real quick and then we'll be on our way. Oh yeah, it doesn't cost any money. I think it would, but nope. Alright, let's get moving, huh? 
Nice. Now, I'm so sure there's like a pattern to how you do this. I'm just gonna... Actually, I'll be back until I figure it out. Alright, so I remembered what that badge is in there, and I realized I don't want it. That badge is not helpful. So we're just gonna move on. We're gonna get this star piece, which we saw last episode, and we're just gonna move on to the next area. Because... Oh no! Okay, so basically, when you get hit by a first strike, it does damage to you. That was a big oopsie, but we can live with that. But first, let's show off Coop's, Cooper's ability now. He has Shell Toss and Power Shell. Let's just show off Power Shell for now, since it's just Shell Toss, but it does more damage, and it does that. Alright, so now we're just gonna take off, take out the Koopa Troopa. Look at that, he can't jump. And I messed up the timing. Alright, so we'll take out the Koopa. Why did I do that? Why did I do that? Cooper can't attack the Paracoop Troopa. I'm a dummy dumb. Finally, I got that timing right. Alright, let's finish this Koopa, uh, that Goomba off. And let's move on, huh? That's six points right in the bag. Alright. So, let's not have that happen again. I don't like getting hit by the first strike. <coughs> Alright. So, let's move on, and... Yeah, let's keep going. Here's the bridge. Sack of coins? Nope. We got ransacked by the... What the... Alright. Oh. Let's show off Shell Toss, huh? It basically just does that. It does one damage. It's better against Koopa more, but... I'm just a little bit worried about... Yeah, even... Yeah, sometimes some enemies will still do damage. Even... Excuse me. Even if you block it. Like the Goomba here. He still does damage either way. He basically lets you half your damage if you're able to block the attack. So some of these guys are a little dangerous. Alright, let's move on. And look at that. What is that guy's... Oh. Can't get it, huh? So we'll go back up instead. And we'll use Cooper's new ability. And bam. But first, let's take out this Goomba, huh? And that's the power of Cooper. Taking out all of the spiked Goombas all at once. That could have been much more dangerous. Now let's get this item and... Look at that sign real quick. Thunderbolt. It just does damage, but it only does it to one enemy. No entry allowed. Yours truly, the Koopa Bros. Oh no, look at that. We can't get the item. It's on the other side of the river. Ha, no, that's literally a Koopa Sword. Alright, yeah. So basically... Oh! That Paracutrupa did not... That was just a rude paratrooper. But these are new enemies. They're paratroopas, like I said. Yeah, they they are actually kind of... They're pretty strong. But more defensively than anything. I'm going to let Tattle do... No, I hit the Koopa Troopa! Oh, my God. That was a waste of a turn. All right, well... I'm just going to attack the Koopa Troopa then. Get that timing once again. Okay, let's tattle the right thing this time. This is a paratroopa. No surprises here. Paratroopas are Koopa Troopas with wings. Max HP is 4, attack power 1, defense power 1. When you jump on them, use a pal block. Their wings fall off and become a normal Koopa Troopa. So easy to beat them once they're normal Koopa Troopas. Give it another jump attack. You'll think they're pretty cool because they wear their sunglasses, but they're not that tough. That's true, they're not that tough at all. Yeah, but they do take time to beat, and that's the annoying part. Plus, they only give two star points. They don't, they're just, they Goombas that take a longer amount of time to beat. And that's what I find annoying about them. But hey, they're easy to beat at the end of the day, so. Let's just finish up this battle real quick, and let's get those four star points that we have to reluctantly take. Especially now that we're two away from leveling up. I'm gonna run into a battle on purpose now. <coughs> hmm. 
No, that was a little bit of lag there. That's weird. Let's check this tree. Oh, no, 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 no. We'll check the tree after. We'll check the tree after. And that is it. All right, we are now about to level up, boys. -da 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 -da. We have leveled up. All of our HP and FP is healed. And what are we upgrading this time? BP. Probably wondering why BP. Why would you want to upgrade HP? Because you did FP last time. Well, let's go to our badges and look at this. This costs three BP, but we do an HP plus, and now we have 15 HP as well. Genius, I say. And here's another star piece. See? Oh, that's that's unfortunate. Have to just take those at times. Ooh, okay. Actually. First, we're going to jump on this paratroopa, who is clearly going to run a muck on everything. Wow, I said muck. I'm a little ashamed of myself. I apologize. Ah, oh, I messed up the timing. Alright, we're back. And look at that. There's a pipe over there. Sadly, we cannot access it yet, but here's a heart point. I think this is a good place to stop. We're gonna go into like a lot of new things next episode. So, yeah, I think this is a good time to stop right now. So, next time on Paper Mario, we're gonna go into Koopa Fortress, and yeah. See you guys then.